<laughs> Welcome back to another horror vlog where I keep you guys up to date with what's going on in the world. And today's topic, well, I'm going to just follow up with the last video I did, which is the Welcome to the Congregation. Something I want to mention is a few things you can do once you've gotten into the congregation, besides scrolling through and seeing the news and the Torah codes, which is equally important, so don't quit scrolling just because of that. Check it daily. That's what I do sometimes. I check it ten times a day because there's always new information, new things that are going on, and that's just what we're trying to do is keep this group going as in, well, the news, teachings, tour codes, there's a lot of it, and there's a lot going on. But on top of that, there is a file section that you need to check out. And then on top of that, we have a Rayolite teachings group. So if you're not familiar with that group, don't forget to join it because, you know, you always have to learn. There's something that I've learned about being in the clergy is you never stop learning. You never stop growing. It's just an amazing experience, and each time you grow more and more, you get stronger. Grr. <laughs> but not only, like, when you're in a clergy, and people look in from the outside, they expect you to be a certain way. Our clergy is different from other people's churches and that is something that you have to understand there's going to be different ways of teaching people there's different teachings in general and some things you may not understand and if you don't understand something the best way to do is put a question in this group because we don't know what to teach you if you don't ask questions I know that a lot of people are already doing that, and thank you for doing that, because that lets us know that you're paying attention, you're asking questions. You, it's, it's just amazing how many people are in our congregation. There's a lot. <laughs> Something else I want to mention is I want you every day, so take a moment and pray. In fact, let's say a prayer right now. Dear God, I want to thank you for this day. Thank you for all of these blessings that you have put upon me and my brothers and my sisters. And may I rebuke any evil spirits any demons and I cast them out in the name of the Lord Rael. Amen. Now how long did that take? A few minutes? Maybe a minute? Not long. If you can't take a few minutes for God how do you think he's going to have time for you? That's a big question to swallow, by the way. But that will be in next week's video. So stay tuned, and may God bless you in the name of Lord Rail. Amen.